abusia for video we omo e she e circulate o social media no so nya ne se e ye obroni bi a oba Ghana obedi ni holidays e na omo ye ni interview e na obroni no ameki comment bi na comment yi nya comment e ya de foforo e ye comment a e ye freedom fighters a e wo all over the world omo e kasa se o man ye infect the country no e ka no the same thing a woman yin so e ka Eh, uh, you could hear someone a woman in Eka, a one in Casa, you mean, yes, I think so. Yes, our parliamentarians, our politicians who are fighting yeah. fiercely against Oh, them. you know, your, your parliament is corrupted anyway, so who are you going to believe anyway if they tell you this is green and it's yellow? Our parliament is corrupt? Yeah. Ah, what look, experience look, have you had with it? You don't even live here. 65 years of independence, and what happened? Look, you, it, the roads are man made roads. If the car doesn't drive over it, it's, ma it's man made roads. The man is driving over it to make it. Whoa. Your government is just not taking care of the people. Is that what you think? Or yes. That's what that, seen? That's what I'm, you don't live here. That's what I'm seeing. You don't live here. I don't live here, but I see it. You know, your kids should have free education, mm. you should have free national health. Mm. Why does Parliament need so many cars sitting on a drive in the sunlight? Because they, they need it for comfort. They only have one backside to sit in a seat. Mm. So why have so many cars? It's not the Queen doesn't have all those cars in Britain. Really? Yeah. She goes out in one car. But she can afford as many cars uh, as She possible. can. She doesn't waste her money like that, though. She doesn't store it just for herself. You think it's an African problem? I think so. Unfortunately, the people of Ghana are suffering purely because the government is greedy and selfish and they're just not sharing the money with the people. They'll be mad at you I for don't coming care, to their country, allowing you in Ghana to experience the free... I don't care. They know that it's the truth. Know, it's like everything. the police. You know when you're coming in the night and you've got all this uh, barriers control mm. with the police and they're looking for a small peswa. Mm. You can't do that in UK, policeman. But you give them. You don't give no, them. No, I don't give them. I'm a Bruni. You hey, Charlie. I told them I know Chief of Commission. Don't worry, I will report them. <laughs> you don't give them, so why are you complaining about yeah, them? Yeah, because the person I might be with is giving them, that's He's why. Them. That's the yeah, thing. That's they the feel thing. obliged to give them. But you, that's, they're beggars in uniforms. But even though our system is, is corrupt, like you said, you are enjoying it. I'm enjoying it, I'm paying. I'm not living here for free. Right. So I'm bringing money into the country, isn't You're it? bringing money into the country. Yeah, babe. So what do you think should be done? For your government, I don't know. I'm not a politician. I'm not, not politician. into. I'm You've not into politics. More than a politician. <laughs> <laughs> and when it's time for the case, you say you're not a politician. I'm not a politician. Yeah. I'm just very sad for the people that are not getting what they should be getting. That okay. Uti ya semwa umani ka eh wakasa kama pa eh semwa debi ni ano mo eh bohu de uruya na mami eh kin. Na ugo piemu eh wo eh Thai fans wa eh resident. If our comment is very important. Residents eh wohon so eh e buo fugi digi 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 ni nani se eh e kwanye ombe faso eh di ako mu fi mu so ubin so ah waso eh contractor eh timi abishi anuya eh di agu kwanye ni mu ni nama se se ino omu ni nyakwanye eh unko omu fi e fi mu no omu kase kura ni timi unko emba ene no omu kase ombe fixi na se se eh kase emu se adi ni nyak em fixi enwe yenti ni se mu eko so if people a lot of assurance that their deplorable roads will get done. But for residents in this side of Taifa, which is close to the Taifa market, they say that these latrites have been abandoned here for close to a week and it is affecting their businesses and their livelihoods. We've been speaking to some of them. I don't live here. I'm in London and um, now and then I'm here. If not, I'm over there. So what's happening? Oh, what is happening is as you see it. Why they did that, nobody knows. They never t t told anybody. You don't know who done it, and this is the situation we are. How's it affecting you? It affects me very bad, not only me, but you know, you can't enter your house. When I came yesterday, I have to, uh, right now I have to go some miles to put my car, and this is not good. They should have let people know residents know before they do this stupid thing since they started working i mean you need to consider the people in the area i know people a lot of people in the house that um, have things in the house to move then because of this thing they came to do here i mean it's been almost a week yeah it's a week already and then nothing has been done uh, the next street behind us too has been the same thing going on 
I mean, you block almost all accesses to the whole area, and uh, it doesn't really uh, tell well. I mean, the contractor doing this project should know better that people are doing businesses. I have cars in the house I'm supposed to move out to sell, and they are just stuck up. There's nothing you can do. So, I mean, the contractor knows what to do. This is one of uh, the cars Nana is selling. It's, a, it's an S-Class Mercedes. And he's had to pack it here because the road leading to his house has been blocked as a result of the, uh, the heaping of these latrites on the road. Before I have to go to, I have to offload my tents in front of my shop. Now I can't do that. I have to move all the way to the street take part of the street and offload the goods over there. Now what is happening is I have to pay extra money for my workers to offload and carry the things right down to that place. That's inconvenient. How long has this been? Almost seven days now. Seven days, yeah. We all park our cars along the road. And you can imagine the dust. What is going to happen? Well, this is where I live. And uh, I think I was sleeping somewhere in the morning, between morning and afternoon. I heard some, they were doing some work. I know construction is going on. So I didn't come out to find out what it, it was. I just, I just got up to realize they have deposited this, in, is it latrite or gravel, you call it, up to the end there. So I said, oh, so does that mean we can go out? Assuming there's an emergency, what happens? As, okay, in the unlikely event that maybe there's fire or so, fire tenders have to come in here. What do you do? What do you do? You see, it's so irresponsible. I don't know what, what goes into the minds of some Ghanaian workers. I don't know. I don't know. So since Tuesday, I've not been able to move my car out. This is my house. I am a demon, sir. I'm in contact with the government. I went there. I, I, I went there to see the foreman. Please talk to me. I mean, uh, okay. To see the foreman. And he told me that by today, they saw everything will be done. And look at this. I have my car parked in there. All of us, all our cars are parked. I have to rent a car mm -hmm. to move around, or else where do I find my daily bread? Huh? This is the question. So, yeah, I'm asking you help me answer this. The problem is they know so. Look, look, look at this. At least they could have at least yes. moved this Move here, this. They could and then they could have been spaced and, and shifted this yes. so that so we can pass through. Yeah. We're locking. That's all we can say. We We're locking, so they have to come and move <laughs> the job going because we can be sitting here and see this. This is no good. You, you can see it. If there is a fire outbreak in, in the house on this lane or all over here, a whole community, you put them into a, this, this kind of situation from, from, from Tuesday, Tuesday till, to, till now. From if there is a fire outbreak, let me ask you, if there's a fire outbreak over here, how do the fire service people come here? Then the fire service will stand over there and they say the fire service did not, did not do their job well. Their job. What about the ambulance? They are not able to enter. So what do they say? They say the ambulance are not able to do their work. Who's the contractor? Do we don't know. We, we, I, we even want to know the contractor and to ask him wherever, wherever he, he lends his con construction work. So look, look at, my, look at my leg. My car is parked inside and, I, and I'm a lecturer. I have to go to work. I have to take a trotter to work or what? And I don't, I don't work here. Are you getting it? And my car is parked inside. Are you getting it? Just because of this, this way. You are doing very good. You are doing a good job, but then the job must be done well. We're going to put in a suit. We'll sue them because of these inconveniences. For the number of days, they'll get this thing done well. They are doing a good job. It is good to construct a good road to get the road done well, but the approach. Meanwhile, Maintenance engineer for the Gang East Municipal Assembly, Caesar Saki, has called on the residents to exercise patience as the project will inure to their benefits in the long run. He assured that pressure will be mounted on the contractor to clear the situation by Monday. You know, we have the contractor working in the area and uh, he has gotten to a stage where he's supposed to bring the gravels and you know, come and spread. So I think uh, they, they, they have brought the gravels on back. It's like where the gravels uh, keep the, 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 the gravels, it, it's like it, it has blocked 
some things and so i'm sure by monday you will just come to site to come and spread it the, the, the people will. it's unfortunate that uh, it has happened like that but normally when there's a construction work going on within the community these are some of the difficulties sometimes the residents go to at the end of the day they are going to you know benefit so i'll plead with them that they should uh, bear with that i'll make sure by monday the contractor comes to site to come in. okay it will tell you sleep more unless i know some Contracta na kasan or say by Monday and ne go from some munya home. O mo e pack or mukao mu fee. A de achi o mu kwe juma. Win a betrino kwa na we go, win a betrino kwa na we go. Contractor say ene, obehead obey a fah. Ni mwa venture obeti mlo commentaba. Ubeti mi a subscribe to your channel no se de be the video two on sabe kenti. U we aya she ni mi ado mano soso. Video ni beto wa na wons weti me hunye bi na wons wahwe. A fin sufa comment in suku video na se. You check it here a page, you know, so you only say Nippon must subscribe to your channel, no? A 51.8%, 48 48.2 and subscribe. A bit must subscribe now, so I become a 51.8, you know. And I finish your check here a geographic no? location, no? A Nippon must subscribe, no? Can you boost your home? US leading can you can a tosso, Germany in a tosso, Ghana, but I'm saying Italy, but the BIA one also bit me a subscribe. Now, if you watch it, now no comment in so good video, I say like a page, you know. Now, if you want me to do my own, so video number two announce when you be a hurry. Me dá-se.